I'm Tim from Tim Marner Branding Agency in Bolton and today we are going to show you how and why we redesigned the logo for Undivided who sell luxury brands online. So stay tuned to see how we change this into this. <music> Undivided is first and foremost a luxury brand driven company. They know people buy luxury goods from them because their audience trust and appreciate that brand. They are at the centre of what matters to modern affluent consumers and influencers. That's why Undivided's team analyses the online popularity of the world's best luxury brands and then make them the most sought after brands available to buy online. With this being said, we thought their logo didn't really match this feeling of luxury brand. Although there's nothing wrong with their logo, we thought we could give it the same powerful brand identity as some of the products they're selling. So when someone receives an undivided bag with a logo on, they get the same feeling as the box that they take out of it. Any well-designed fashion logo can impact your brand's perceived value. Their original logo is a word mark with the emphasis being on the V in the middle that changes colour for either blue for Mr Undivided or pink for Miss Undivided. We're not really sure why the V has an emphasis on it but feel that this could maybe have been done as an afterthought as they've grown the brand. We like the word undivided which gives the feeling of being devoted completely to one thing and not separated or broken into parts which gives the sense of community and connection that they are having with their customers. And it's this feeling that we wanted to keep but alongside this we wanted to give the visual identity a bit of edge because they're positioning their brand with personalities like H. So with H as inspiration we wanted to break the rules with our logo and do something different by doing exactly what the brand name is telling us not to do and that's dividing the logo society is always telling us to do something like everyone else and abide by its rules and it's people like h that stand up and eat boundaries and wash it down with a hot cup of steaming rules and this is what we wanted for the logo. So when people look at it, they will go, you can't do that. Um, you're doing the opposite of what I'm telling you to conform to. We chose Helvetica as the font for this, as we knew when we divided the logo, it would still sit nicely together, but also not be too far away from what they already had. So we thought just like division in mathematics when you stack the numbers on top of each other to get the sum we would do this with our logo so we took the divided and placed it under the di so it's still red divided and the d and the v and the i's would sit perfectly aligned under each other the thought really in the back of our heads was to yes divide the logo but we still wanted to undivide it at the same time and this will put the emphasis on the un for us to change the colour to either blue or pink, depending what channel it's going on. It's the un really that needs the focus on because it's this that keeps undivided from falling apart. And this is it, a brand new visual identity for our friends over at Undivided. Remember, to break the rules, you first have to understand them.